Hi. This is a practice that is fundamental, really, for any yoga practice that you might step into. It is dedication. What separates yoga, asana practice, from any sort of physical activity you might do from a sport uh, is intention and dedication and offering the practice up and over perhaps to someone else in your life that could use the energy. Or maybe you have to give all that energy back to yourself and make this a moving meditation, a flowing practice that is dedicated to you dedicated to cultivating an energy within yourself that is balanced, that is healing, that is generous and giving so that you can send this energy, this light forward. This is a bhakti practice, a practice of devotion. So, that sounds like a lot, doesn't it? <laughs> it's also really fun. Yeah, so let's come to sit. If you have a block, it's helpful. Uh, and handy as we'll start seated on the heels. Oh, I feel better already. And then plant the hands, right hand on top of left, thumbs to touch. Close the eyes and take a breath back into the center of yourself. Start to call up what you want to bring forward within, the energy, the light you want to radiate. And as you breathe in, belly, ribs, chest, suspend. Stay uplifted as you exhale, chest, ribs, belly, plant roots in the earth. As you feel the breath rolling in like waves all the way up to the peak, then channeling back down deep into the center of the earth. Fill the heart space up and awaken to your intention, your motivation, your dedication for your practice here today. So that you can move from this heart space, generously allowing the breath to unfold, taking a breath back into the center of yourself, and perhaps as you open your heart a little wider, you start to sense who in your life could use a little bit of yoga, a little bit of breath and space, love unconditionally. Maybe it's a person, maybe it's a pet. Those tend to be safer. <laughs> or maybe you need the love. So center yourself. Be all heart right here, right now. And then scoop the palms forward as though you were going to dive into a deep well. A little forward fold. You might even rest your head, maybe even rest your head in your hands, bowing, humbled by this opportunity to pause, to offer your practice to yourself, someone else, and then bring the energy back up and tap the back of the heart. So you're sort of combing through your mind here. Press out through the heels of the hands and then scoop and gather again, just breathing in, scooping up the energy. Bring the hands, maybe heels of hands to eyes and then comb through your mind. Tap the back of the heart, open the chest, and then press out and clear the heart space. One more time. Dive in. Pause. Comb through any other resistance. See if you can step out of your own way and start to move for someone else. 
maybe for your highest self. And then exhale, bow forward. Take the hands to the floor. You can still hug the block between your knee or your ankles there and kind of gather the inner thighs together. And as you exhale, lower down, kiss the earth. And then walk the fingertips out. Cobra variation. Take the right shoulder down, turn the other cheek. Inhale, left side. Super mellow. Come back to center. Inhale. Scoop the low belly in. Swim the arms back. Gather the block between the feet there. And then lift up belly, then ribs, then chest. Keep your head on your spine. Maybe you even lift the legs and try to pick the block up too. Pick up the front ribs. And then exhale, bow. Plant your hands, press back. All fours. Walk the hands underneath your heart center. And again, we're just starting to feel this vibration, the heart channel flowing into the palms of the hands. As you exhale, coiling up, drawing the roots of the earth up into your back body. And again, swim on through the shoulders, lift the heart, still gathering that block, pressing in tops of the feet, and then exhale, scoop it out. Inhale, come back to neutral. Integrate the front body into the back body. Right arm threads open. And then scoop it through, thread the needle, a little twist. Just a breath here to draw the front body in, look over your shoulder, and then back to center. Inhale, opposite side, reach up, and then exhale, thread across the heart center. Draw down through the, the skull, but feel a buoyancy through the hips, this traction through the spine. Rotate. And then come on back through center. Inhale, plant the palms. Curl the toes under. Maybe hold onto that block again. And then bottoms up, take the hips towards the sky. And rattle. Loose any thoughts you're attached to, any way of being in the world that doesn't serve you. And step out of your own way here. Exhale. Inhale, rise up on the balls of the feet. And drop the knees down. Sit your hips back and down and adjust your block. Maybe sitting up a little higher this time. Oh, we're back at the beginning. 